in this way in this triple five timer ic by changing the input we can control the timing of the output signal and by connecting external component like push button led capacitor resistors this triple five timer can be configured either as monostable bistable or astable multi vibrator We have used these external components and this triple five timer IC can be configured as a stable multi vibrator. Let's connect the external components with triple five timer IC on a Vero board and complete the soldering part. Now let's connect it with the battery and attach the battery with double sided tape. Here a LED is connected to pin 3 of triple 5 timer with a resistance of 150 ohm. Pin 2 is connected to pin 6. A capacitor is connected with pin 2 and ground. Pin 6 is connected to pin 7 with a variable resistance and pin 7 is connected to pin 8 with a 10 kilo ohm resistor. Let's take a look at how a stable multi vibrator works internally. We have already discussed in the previous video that power supply or VCC is divided into two parts 2 by 3 VCC and 1 by 3 VCC. If power supply voltage is 9 volt then in a negative terminal of comparator 1 gets 2 by 3 VCC is equal to 2 by 3 into 9 is 6 volt and in a positive terminal of comparator 2 gets 1 by 3 VCC is equal to 1 by 3 into 9 is 3 volt. Here voltage applied to pin 2 and pin 6 is set by the capacitor voltage. When power supply is connected at first capacitor voltage is 0. Comparator 2's negative terminal or pin 2 or trigger pin gets lower voltage than the comparator 2's positive terminal. Comparator 2's positive terminal takes priority and comparator 2's output becomes high so that triple 5's output pin 3 becomes high and LED has been turned on. The capacitor charges and when the voltage is above one third VCC or above 3 volt comparator 2's negative terminal takes priority and comparator 2's output becomes low but the triple 5 continues to output high. When the capacitor charges higher than two third VCC or higher than 6 volt, comparator 1's positive terminal or pin 6 or threshold pin gets higher voltage than the comparator 1's negative terminal. Comparator 1's positive terminal takes priority and comparator 1's output becomes high. Resetting the triple 5 output to low, LED has been turned off. This also turns on the transistor of the discharge pin and the capacitor begins to drain. Dropping below to 2 third VCC or dropping below to 6 volt, comparator 1's negative terminal takes priority and comparator 1's output becomes low. But triple 5 continues to output low. Dropping below to 1 third VCC or dropping below to 3 volt, voltage at pin 2 or comparator 2's negative terminal is lower than 3 volt. Comparator 2's positive terminal takes priority, comparator 2's output becomes high and triggers the triple 5's output pin 3 too high, turning on the LED again. This cycle of capacitor charging up to above 2 third VCC, turning the LED off and draining back down to below 1 third VCC, turning the LED on, will continue as long as the circuit is connected with the power supply.
तब तक के लिए जय हिंद और वीडियो अच्छा लगे तो प्लीज यार लाइक शेयर और सब्सक्राइब तो बनता है ना सब्सक्राइब कर दो